No blows low here. Touch your gloves to your corners. Robson Conceição has mm, to make good for what happened in that Louis Correa fight, which was a war, but many of us thought he lost that fight, so he's got a lot to prove tonight. Ain't no doubt he lost that fight. I mean, honestly, two points was taken away. Then he got knocked down. I mean, that's four That's four rounds right there in the bag for Correa. And you don't think Correa won maybe at one or two rounds in the back end of that fight? Come on. He got a gift. He's moving forward. Good for him. And now he's in the ring. Ooh, wow. He's throwing leather combinations from Robson Conceição, who gets caught with a stiff jab from the Sonoran, Jesus Antonio Almada, who's been in Los Angeles the last three months, working with Edgar Cruz, who's working his corner alongside Marco Contreras. But tonight, when you get a fighter who you don't know who he is. Conce Sal is not allowing him to think in there. So he's just jumping him early in this round. Nice, nice jab to the body from Conce Sal. 100 fights. I think that's plenty, 150, but 400 amateur fights, gold medalist, 32, and hasn't fought for a world championship? Wow, time could be running out for him. Yeah, well, he didn't win a medal in 2008 in Beijing, and so he stuck around till Rio 2016 and finally won a gold medal in his home country, and that meant a lot to him, so. Yeah, Amada just huh. bending down, not moving his head, can't get past the right hand of Kase Sao. Not even rolling underneath it. I mean, he's hit three times. That's four right there. Nice counter punching there from Conceição now, who allows Almada to get off first. Nice left hook from Robson. Conceição who follows up with a nice right uppercut. It's just using his jab. <laughs> That's what he's doing. It doesn't matter. You can have the reach advantage, but you can take that away by shooting your jab and jabbing with your opponent, getting your head off the line as well. You see the blood splitting from the nose of Jesus Antonio Almada, who continues to take damage from Conceição. See, Almada doesn't have a whole lot of punching power, Bernardo, so Conceição doesn't fear anything coming back. You know, he got hit clip right there with yeah. a left hook. Didn't really do much to him, so he's willing to stand there and trade and take some punches so that way he can land his power shots like that. Okay. You know, he's been through a lot. He's one of nine kids. Grew up in Salvador Bahia as a kid that he once had to fake an arm injury. He went to the hospital. They wrapped the, his hand in the ba in the bandages and yeah. he used those to wrap his hands and, and go sparring in the gym. So he's had it rough, but he's making it rough for Jesus Antonio Almada here with those quick combination punches. Nice mm. right hand from Robson Conceição. It also gives you a, a good reason to continue. Yes. To press forward. Yes. Exactly. I'm sure those are the things that were going through his mind. Everything he's had to go through and everything he's putting Almada through here in round two of a scheduled eight rounder. But Almada now letting his hands go as well. It's hard to really get rid of bad habits. Like you create so many bad habits in the amateurs and it follows you in the pros. And as you can see, oh. Conceição, yes, he's... He's doing his thing, he's getting Almada, but I mean, as he steps up the competition. He's used to tapping guys for points. Yes. It's, it's a whole different ball game when you've got to hurt your opponent and get out of the way because there may be something coming back as round two is coming to an end here at the Osage Casino in Tulsa, Oklahoma. Robson Conceição clearly in control by Bernardo Osuna <laughs> alongside Timothy Bradley. And you see the aggressiveness. Great instructions from his trainer in the corner. Now he's just got to go out there and execute the plan. Nice quick combinations upstairs, downstairs. Conce Sal. Not a whole lot of punching power on it. Not a whole lot of sting on it. You see those shots right there are slapping shots. He's yes. not turning those shots over. And that's why in a fight against a guy like Louis Correa who comes forward, he can walk through those punches yes. and make it a war. And... and come out with the better result, you know, in everybody's eyes except the judges, in, in that case in Las Vegas. Yeah, yeah, and I also see Amada trying to come forward. He's trying to fight fire with fire, you know, getting aggressive, and that's just, you know, his his temperament. You know, he is a counterpuncher. He likes to fight off the back foot, but Kansei Sao is not allowing him to do that, so what is he doing? He's changing gears. You know what? You want to fight? Let's fight. I knew a guy who was like that. Yeah, I was the same way, man. I'm not going to lie, bro. I, did, I would get bored in there, man, honestly. I would get bored in there and, and just, you know, and, the, and the, the fans start booing, boo. I didn't like that. See, Conceição out there with the defensive prowess and to 
Stem the tide in his favor here in round three, but he, once again, he gets caught with the simplest punch in the book. The jab just stops him in his track, and then that sets up a left hook to the jaw. It's funny. Anytime you see a guy posturing in front of you with his hands down, you, you got to understand that he's trying to set you up for something. He's trying to bait you. And that's what Kansei Sao did there. That's experience, experience from the amateurs inside the gym as well in sparring. So he's just trying to set up Ahumada, and he got him a throw, and he countered him. There you see. Quick, accurate. Consistent offensive output from Robson Conceição. Yeah, I mean, he doesn't have the one punch knockout power, but you know, these punches accumulate over time, and, and you can see the wear on Abamada's face, the redness, the blood dripping down his face. So they, they do have effect. Yeah. Ooh, nice right hand from Almada after getting stopped once again with the jab in his tracks. There's something there, you know, there's a lot of heart in Almada, but he's taking a lot of shots from Robson Conceição through the first three nine minutes of this fight. Lightweight, a junior lightweight attraction here at the Osage Resort and Casino in Tulsa, Oklahoma. Bernardo Osuna alongside Timothy Bradley. And let's see if Almada can be a lot more effective with his punches here in round number four against Conceição. Not much behind that nice left hook there from Gonsei Sao. And this is where he starts to accumulate that punishment. You know, three, four punch combinations. A lot more crisp. See, I always worry about fights like this where guys just take flush shots like that, power shots like that. You know, because he's not the biggest puncher, you know, up here with Salcedo. You know, a brain, a brain bleed. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's the thing. Sometimes... What we saw earlier is, is better for a fight. These type of shots can have consequences down the line. Yeah. You know, it's shots to the head constantly. You know, MMA, you land a hard shot, guy falls on the ground, you come ground and pound, and it's over. You know, just as you said. Just as you just said. We see those nice right hands from Conce South. And these shots, Tim, he's turning them over because he's getting full leverage on these. But Almada's taking some good shots here. Yeah, I mean, it, it, I mean, he's fighting back. Almada's fighting back. Don't get me wrong, but man, all those shots move your head. Yeah. <laughs> no, I mean, if I'm in this corner and I'm seeing my guy, yeah, you're giving some good shots, but you're taking more than you're giving. I start getting a little worried. We're four rounds in, and I mean, it's just replaying round one every time. It's just dominance from Robson Conceição on the this. offensive end. Look at his face. Oh, what don't you understand about those instructions, Leonardo? <laughs> <laughs> Like, hey, just stay away from that right hand. Oh, he's getting hit with the right hand every single yeah, time. That's why they said, stay, you know, keep jumping and move out of that right hand. Now he lands a nice left hook counter against Robson Conceição. Ooh, now it's both guys trading. It's the right hand from Conceição against the left hook of Jesus Antonio Almada. You no, know, use your jab. Stay fundamentally sound, you know, stay behind the knee. Stop just, you know, shooting shots to shoot shots. Make them count. Make them count, man. And if he wants to get to the next level, because he's going to need to quickly, he needs to work on these things. It's a beautiful pull counter right there from Kansei Sal. Look, and, and you're right. At this point, Gonsai Sao is completely in control, but do you have the next level goods? And, and that's what we've seen lacking in Robson Gonsai Sao. The blood on Gonsai Sao's trunks is not his own, it's his opponent, Salmada. as you're throwing a shot. It's like double impact. Yeah. You see, it's double effective for the opponent that lands the cleanest. And that's yeah. what happened right there with Almada. Yeah, and then the nice left hook there from Robson Gonzalez out to the chin of Jesus Antonio Almada. Bro, nice look at that. Two. I mean, come on. Those are clean one-two punches straight down the middle. You know, no way, no way to escape it at all. Yeah. What's the point of you even going out the next round, son? Yeah. And it's every shot that Conceição is throwing at this point. 
you got to save the fighter from himself because this man, Almada, he's going to fight to the end. Punch out, punch out. Steam in the punches of Almada at this point. You see them slow, they're off rhythm, and, and that's where the corner really has to look at what chance does my guy have after giving up the first five rounds. He's undefeated, but to no, win but that he, championship. He wants to get to that elite level and, yeah. and to get a shot at those guys. Yeah. You do, and you got to fight stiffer competition. I mean, this is 16 fights in for the 2016 Olympic gold medalist, five years into his career now, and he's landing big shots, but Almada's there. Nice counter left there from Robson Gonsaisal. Mm. Just too many shots at this point, and the corner really needs to look at, dig deep within themselves and say, look, my guy's got no shot at this point. Man, you look at his so face, right. man. Look at his face. Look like dog meat, man. Terrible. It's hard to be, it's easy to be brave with somebody else's physique. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's his health. You got to take care of him. He's game. He's fighting back. Almada's fighting back. He's fighting back. He's fighting hard. Yeah, but that's who he is. That's what he knows. He's a warrior. He's he's a fighter from Sonora. He, he knows what that means. Nice left hook there from Conceição, who slowed down his rhythm, but he's landing bigger shots because Almada is opening up. See, Almada's opening up, and what Conceição is doing right now, he's just... He's playing the cat and mouse right now, playing defense, and he's just waiting on the perfect time to be able to punch and catch Almada in between oh. shots like that. That's exactly what's going on here. He's allowing Almada to punch himself out. You can see that there's no rhythm to the way Almada's punching, and that's exactly what Robson Conceição is taking advantage here in this sixth round. Ooh, nice body shot from Conceição. Stop, stop, stop. My English is not so good. My English. Oh, Tim. Oh, my goodness. Right with a right right there. Mm -hmm. Once again, and there's a big right hand from Robson Conceição. One former world champion, Timothy Bradley. I'm Bernardo Osuna. And Robson Conceição, the Brazilian in the white trunks with gold trim. And he's got to spit some venom if he's going to get back in this fight. <laughs> More than convincing mm. right now. You need to throw some punches. Get move his head, please. Please oh. move your head. While Conceição is moving it for him, then that's an unfortunate thing for Jesus Antonio Mada. There's inflammation under both eyes. His mouth is open. Look at, it, look at his jaw. Look at the right side of his jaw. Yes. How swollen it is. I agree. Visions of Oscar Valdez. This was a clean mat before this fight, and now it's all full of Go Jesus Antonio Almada's blood, and down goes Almada. Three, and this four, should be it. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. You want to go? No. no. Thank no. goodness that the referee winner finally put an end to this fight because he was the only guy who could save Almada from himself. His corner was not going to do it. He did his job as a referee, who went to the body, landed a left hook, and that was it. Hey, right on the temple. You know, it's a beautiful shot. He was hurt by the body shot, no doubt about it. Straight right hand, right down to the solar plex. Boom, he steps back. You see him, how his back kind of folded up, his stomach folded in, and then, you know, he goes down. For your winner by knockout. Robson, Nino, Concesao!